Hello, I am Aris and in this video I am going to show you how to create undead project using the latest version of undead indexer. Undead indexer is a software to import your point cloud files and convert it to undead project. So after opening undead indexer, the first step is to select project type. And here are four available choices. The first one is for regular size buildings and interior modeling projects. The second is for infrastructure object and larger building modeling projects. The third selection is for large scale topography and corridor mapping projects. And the last option is for large scale airborne leader data management projects. So in this example, I will choose first project type. And in this, this next dialog, we need to import our point cloud files. And as you can see on my screen, and that supports wide range of different point cloud file formats. So you can easily import any point cloud file from a different laser scanning or photogrammetry software. To do that, simple click add files select point cloud files which you want to import into undead and after adding this file to this window if it's necessary you can select some files and move these files to the logical groups for example let's see it will be inside scans Selecting another files, external scans, and this grouping will help you in the future when you will start working with undead plugins. And when everything is set up, the last thing to check is settings. These settings affect project creation time and the compatibility with different undead plugins. For example, setting project will be used with undead for AutoCAD only affects AutoCAD users because to load point cloud files into AutoCAD, we need to create additional files. The second option, create an RCP file for use with undead for Revit. This setting is optional and by enabling that you can create additional rcp file together with undead project the third option is to create undead browser project and if you are importing structured files with bubble view information you can create additional undead browser project will allow you to use full undead features Setting to remove duplicate points with 2 mm spacing will allow you to remove high density areas. For example, if you are placing scanner near to the wall, scanner measure a lot of points on that wall and these points are useless. So by using this setting, you can easily eliminate that from that project. Using global project boundaries feature, you can specify the area limits where to create an that project and eliminate unnecessary data by writing min max coordinates of that limit area. Separate project feature is not often used, but by enabling this feature, you can create individuals and that project for each imported file or created group so that's all about settings when everything is set up just simply click create project once again software will show settings window press ok write down project name Uh, 
and now and that will index all imported files and convert it to on that project during this video I will speed up this process because the project creation times depends on the imported point cloud file size and of course the settings which you set up so the once and that project is created you could go to the direction where you saved and that project and in that direction you will find two files one file will be epcp and next to that file will be the folder with the same name so please keep it in mind that it is on that project and if you will share that project with your team members or customers please send these two files thank you for watching and see you on the next video